Screen printing to stays despite onset of digital compliments. Everywhere around logos, designs and art shows up and comes out of the woodwork using a modernized version of an older technology. Using modern state-of-the-art methods and machines, we print them too. Using sublimation heat transfer, transfer vinyl, stickers, mugs, sublimation plates, slippers, baseball caps, logos, photo rock frames, PVC IDs, vinyl waterproof labels and lanyards. But as compared to digital heat transfer process such as vinyl and sublimation which are advisable for small quantities and single orders, screen printing is a helpful way to expose a company name and or logo to the public. It is the most cost-effective way of exposure and is just the right choice for mass-produced materials. Screen printing originally started out using silk as a medium but has since moved on to using stretched porous, finely woven nylon or polyester fabrics, with carefully stenciled designs, and delightful creations take form and come to life. From many of Andy Warhol's famous works to such commonly used items as t-shirts and hats, the practice of stretching a fabric and laying out a non-permeable material to cover areas of the fabric to be unaffected by dyes has created influential and marketable works of art. This inexpensive form of advertising creates a wide range of possibilities for a company, a group, or a certain product or service, to establish itself in the market, or for an already established company to gain great recognition. With a great flexibility and range of uses across different platforms and materials, screen printing has become a widely accepted form of pseudo-media. With uses varying from textiles, ceramics, metal, wood, paper, glass, and plastic, there is not much screen printing cannot accomplish. It remains apparent that screen printing is evident in all walks of life. It is impossible to walk down the street and not see hundreds of screen printed items on a daily basis. Everything from soda bottles, to t-shirts, to coffee mugs, and cars are all screen printed. With such a wide array of uses, screen printing also has many different techniques for being accomplished. The most common form of screen printing is known as photographic emulsion. Simply put, photographic emulsion is a process whereby a photosensitive substance is hardened and subjected to ultraviolet light. Using the desired stencil design, the monochromatic design is transferred onto the vehicles such as the ones listed above, textiles, ceramics, metal, wood, paper, glass, and plastic. The process is completed by rinsing away the excess emulsion that was not hardened by the light in either water or solvent. In the end, it leaves only the desired screen printed image on the medium. Screen printing has grown into great popularity to brand our everyday household items, and familiarize us with famous commercial brands as well. So, what are you waiting for? Inquire now, at Renz Nassal Facebook page, PM is the key. To view more updates, don't forget to like this video and if you are new to my channel please click the subscribe button, share it with your friends and feel free to comment. You may also comment down your proposed future videos for us to consider and possibly create them to the best of our efforts and resources. Again. Thanks and cheers.